Here's uh, Cloud checking out some of my peppers in the can. There's some big guys here. Uh, these are all just going from the seed. <laughs> what you doing? <laughs> Hey everybody, it's August 6th, uh, this will be 14 weeks now that I've been growing stuff in the greenhouse with the hydroponic system, and we've got a bunch of red colors here, some tomatoes are finally coming in, all these big weird looking ones, um, they're pretty tasty too. But I think next year I'm just going to grow these little guys because they turn faster. These guys have been growing for quite a while. And you know, all these little guys are just delicious. And there's a ton of them around. This cucumber is still not going. And, uh, getting a lot of beans. Made a bunch of spicy beans already. It's pretty cool. The ceiling here is eight feet tall. Well, eight feet from the top of the buckets. Pepper going here. Oh, another big cucumber here. Okay, it's ready to go. Bunch of that's there's some scorpions here. Uh, I think that's a ghost, ghost or Carolina Reaper. One of the two. There's three different types on this one. This one I just have in soil. Uh, made some pickles this week. Made some couple jars of spicy beans. Put more peppers here, just in the crack key. Or tomatoes and crack key style, just a bucket with nutrients. And I just use the general hydroponics flora series, some involved celery, uh, getting peppers here, those are good ones. You got more peppers inside growing, I'll flip to that here. Here's what's going inside, I got some peppers here, some cucumbers. That cracky bucket. Another one here with some stringy tomatoes. Uh, this cayenne long slim that I got last week. Bunch of peppers on it already. Oh, one just fell off. Well, I guess that's lunch. And then all the peppers in the can. I'll put them out on the table there and show you. Just got a grow light going on here. So got succulents and peppers and, and some herbs. And some basil. It's I'd like it better hydroponic. Okay, here's the table. Here's the cloud and a couple of my peppers in the can growing. There's some big guys here growing from seeds. Uh, Carolina Reaper ghosts. I don't think there's any scorpions yet. Uh, these are Ring of Fire. Hi, Cloud. Don't need them. Uh, habaneros here. Nothing coming out of them yet. A couple flowers, though. Uh, and on that guy. There's a bunch on this one. It's pretty cool. They're just in beer cans with a couple of holes in the bottom. And just in dirt, these guys. But yeah, it's cool to get some cool cans and fill them up with plants. Right, Cloud? Go knock them over. Okay, back outside. And 
we've got more stuff growing here, which is good. The basil's getting big. Uh, getting some broccoli. So that's cool. It's the biggest broccoli I've grown. Uh, arugula in the back there. Some kale. The Swiss chard's doing well. Some uh, collard greens. Uh, some bok choy. A couple of new habaneros that I just put in this morning again. Some strawberries. Delicious. Uh, the roots are crazy on these guys. The other cool roots in here is this habanero here. It's pretty neat. This guy twisted in. Oh, I'll have to try and do this two handed later. Oh, that's not bad. Uh, I've got more tomatoes on this one. This is just a sucker plant from the big one, the first one. The bush champion. Uh, habanero here starting to flower, which is cool. And then this little cherry tomato one. Tons of these little guys. More cucumbers. Another cucumber. Another one way over here. So this guy's coming from, from here, I guess. Uh, going around. Yeah, it's a jungle in here. Flowers coming. Tomatoes all the way up over here. Got the door open. So the weather's hot. I uh, had some uh, fires starting to change color, so that's a good sign. It means more peppers are, are coming. This peach coast is getting a lot bigger. Oh, a couple flowers there. Looking forward to this one. Oops. So I got the system on a timer, so put every half hour pump comes on. It's the cucumber one. Oh. Wow. Crazy. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Had a bunch of salads this week just with uh, cucumber and tomato and some basil, a bit of feta and balsamic. It's excellent. These pickles are good. I just made uh, refrigerator pickles for, for these guys. And I'll just keep this jar going. I think I'll probably put that guy in there today if there's room. Oh, there's the pump. Hold on. Right. So the pump's on a uh, on a loop here, so it connects down here. So there's and then the one, it's like a figure eight, so it's even pressure and everything. And then everything goes back down into the reservoir. Great little system. Building a little canopy here. Screw one of the coming from both sides, wrapping around each other. Trying to strangle them. But yeah. Some big tomatoes. I need that one today, I think. Alright, so that's uh, this week's tour. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next week.